It's been a day. It's been a week. It's been fun. Do you like my outfit today? Woo! Yeah. So uh, I moved into a small town, and uh, I started watching people again to see how they were, and I realized people were watching me again. And uh, it goes kind of back and forth. And so uh, then I was at Walmart, and I saw these shorts on clearance. No, really, you know, like clearance. Nobody wants to buy bright yellow shorts. And so I thought, you know what, if I wear these out and about, I can just assume they're looking at my butt and not my hands. <laughs> so we'll see how that goes, if yeah. that's a real thing. I don't know. Um, so let's see. I have with the, I'll get back to that with one. I have two poems. I actually sat down and wrote poetry. I'm so excited. This one, this first one is short. It was kind of my warm up that day. Nothing Seems Right is the title. And then there are days when nothing seems right. I try not to panic and wait for the night. I can't pick just one. All these choices appear. I don't know what to say. I just wait out the day. Ah, it's finally dark. Only one option here. I just go to bed, and it soon will be light. That's, uh, that's uh, disappearing in life every so often, having those days where, like, I'm just going to go hide. All right, so this one is, so this whole thing about other people watching me and everything, um, uh, man, tonight was just amazing. <laughs> you reminded me that a lot of the attitudes might not even be in the people I'm seeing, that I might just be assuming they're, being, they're staring at different things, whatever, you know. They could be looking at a friend behind me, who knows, but yeah, yeah. Um, so I've been working on this whole idea that uh, I have uh, cis ableism, where I assume that you all are ableist towards me, <laughs> and that's my own, that's my own problem, and it's something that I deal with. But uh, yeah, so part of this, part of this one, uh, part of that shows up in in this poem, my turn? Question mark. Is it my turn? Something like that. I haven't titled it, and this one's going to get better. So. When do I get to be angry? There, I said it, almost already livid. I don't know why anger appeals to me like that. For one thing, I'm bad at it. I'm pitifully weak. <laughs> when I do boil over, I feel really sad. Or in the middle of it, I laugh at myself. <laughs> why am I yelling? What will that do? But it's truly not fair. I can't tie my own shoe. Still, there are other layers on layers on layers here. He's funny, he's eloquent, he's talented too. Some are envious. I can walk or talk or play a tune. They all seem surprised I do anything at all. See, right there, it drives me insane. The bar, ex the bar of expectation is incredibly low. So just by trying anything at all, I'm a hit. Amazing, inspiring, I could never imagine. It's not so bad, I think, with chagrin. Even when I'm coasting along, they'll call it a win. Then who am I mad at? I'm really not sure. I've been there. I did it. I screamed and I cried. Why me? Who am I to be afflicted by this? I shouted and ranted, but no one replied. The pain and the anguish built up and, well, got boring. So I went outside and found something to try. I think that's my answer then about my turn. I did get angry and threw it all in to burn. Then it was gone. I dove right into it, pushing until I heard that voice talking. I hear it still. It's all good, my friend. There's no need to cry. Let's just all go outside and find something to try. I think that's it for me tonight. Thank you.